Hello, welcome back to another After Effects video. So in this one, I just want to look at a button that we haven't looked at yet, which is um, this button here, which is Preserve Underline Transparency. So that's a pretty convenient way to get the underlying transparency. Another thing you can do as well, is something that I did previously, was if you did a solid layer and just did a mask, See, so you can get it to work something like that. It's a pretty cool way to do like certain effects through text and the background. You can then take also a look at the uh, stencil modes as well. Stencil alpha. Let's see, it's going to do something like that. Silhouette, as you can see here, is an inversion of a stencil. So, if you, so how do I actually get this on a background, right? That is the question. Uh, all you have to do really is just nest it. So yeah, we kind of just have to nest this comp, which is uh, this guy. Uh, and then you can put a background on it. Funnily enough, you probably would need blending modes for something like this, just to get the contrast better. 